Carrer predicted Man United's baffling mistake finally solved by Rangnick. Jamie Carrer's stance that Manchester United made a mistake in signing Donny van de Beek appears to have been proven true. The Dutch international finally ended his Old Trafford nightmare this week, albeit it temporarily, after Ralph Rangnick agreed to loan the outcast to Everton. Big things were expected of Van de Beek following his £35 million arrival from Ajax in September of 2020, but the 24-year-old has been left frustrated after being handed a mere four Premier League starts by the club. The out-of-favour midfielder has now been given an opportunity to prove his worth elsewhere after signing for the Toffees on a six-month loan deal in a move which has seemingly justified the long-standing view of Carrer. Discussing United's midfield woes alongside fellow Sky Sports pundit Gary Neville on Monday Night Football following the Red Devils' 0-0 Premier League draw with Chelsea back in October 2020, Carrer made his feelings on the signing of Van de Beek clear. I actually admire Ole Gunnar Solskjaer for putting Pogba on the bench, the former Liverpool defender began. I said here a few weeks ago, after the Crystal Palace game, Fernandes and Pogba, they're not a midfield together, they can't play together, and they never will be. Van de Beek, I don't understand the signing I really don't, I don't get how he's ever going to play or where he's going to fit in. As soon as he was signed my thought was he plays no.10, Fernandes plays there, Pogba can play there, and you look at it now, and it's better for the team in terms of having Fred and Scott McTominay there. But Fred and McTominay in there aren't good enough for Manchester United or to challenge for the Premier League either. And the big problem for me is Paul Pogba, it has been for a long time. Bruno Fernandes is the man in that no.10 position, but I don't know how Ole can continue to not pick a pounds 90 million player, so he will get back into the team. Does Donny van de Beek have a future at Manchester United? Let us know in the comments below. But for me, him and Fernandes will never work. Carrer's prediction has clearly come to pass as van de Beek has been granted leave after evidently struggling to make his mark under either Solskjaer or Rangnick. The latter appears to have finally solved the conundrum by loaning the Dutch midfielder out for the remainder of the season, but United's insistence on refusing to include an option to buy within his Everton loan deal is telling. The club's managerial dilemma remains the priority at Old Trafford, and a new man at the helm could well entrust Van de Beek with more game time next season, especially if Pogba does indeed depart. The Frenchman has entered the final six months of his current United contract and appears destined to leave the club on a free transfer for the second time given his apparent lack of interest in signing on. His increasingly likely departure could well open up a pathway for Van de Beek into the United first team fold, but for now, at least, Carrer's damning assessment